Hey everyone, you are watching Technology Welfare. In this tutorial, I will show you everything step by step with real demonstrations how to fix lock to owner on any iPhones and devices. As we see, this device has been locked to owner. It's asking enter the ID and password that's where I used to set up this device. We don't know what's the actual ID behind it. Don't worry, without doing a Zelbrex at your home, you can fix it by a similar strategy. So don't skip ahead. Yes, every step is very crucial and important for us to unlock permanently. So first and foremost, guys, we will have to go for energy administrations in your PC, that is iTunes. Go for run as administrations iTunes. Let's have the configuration in a cloud data and Apple data after assessing a data. It's a saying here, we can see, was lost it is enter the Apple ID and password that were used to set up this device. So we don't know what's the actual ID and the password we had it show. Second option, we will go for installation of 3U tools. This driver is absolutely free. In a description box, there is a download links. You can pick it and of course, here, just we will click on a toolbox. We'll go in a crash analysis and here, We'll go the inside of it. We will delete all the files. Why it's essential to wipe out all the data from here? Because whatever the retaining data in an Apple database server, we had to clear so that there will be no retaining data. So, of course, when we give a once again configuration by virtue of iTunes, then there will be no link to this particular ID. So now this thing I have done, we will go for real time logs here. We'll have to clear, almost it has been cleared, so there is nothing coming, just uh, make it, now it's uh, coming here, see? Go for here, now, at least 20 times, guys. So in the midst of, we'll have to back and once again, make it clear, make it clear. Almost to see, guys, here, it has. Make it pass, then make it clear, we will close it, no problem at all from here. Now, this thing also we have done. Now we will come on a, we will come on a imaging PC. Here we will have to clear all the retaining data in a cloud database. So we will click on a especially trial mode and here, just we will come on a, this device has been connected already. So now, just we will cancel it and here, We'll have option show device console. Let's clear all the, let's clear, let's clear. Now we will back one more time and we will make it clear. So now see it's asking password finds. Once again, we will come in here, clear. Now see on the other hand, we have a one RAC mode, hit this one and keep clearing in this console. So now there is nothing, just we will make it pass and then close it. Now here, just we will close this. This iTunes is notifying that your device has been dressed in a recovery mode. Just we will close every Thanks. Now, except the 3U tool, guys. Here we will come in a smart flash. Here, try to uh, download one particular beta version. So, here is a lot of the beta versions. We'll go for latest one. Now, this is the last one, 3A. This IPSW I have already downloaded from ipsw.beta.com. But this can be downloaded from also on this website, that is www.3u.com or directly we can download here also, we can import. So we will prefer to import, otherwise it will take much more time. Total size is approximately 9 GB. So that's why I had decided to firstly download that. This device that came at my soap today, guys. So actually, at the morning time, there was not much time left to a space lamp execute to unlock. So right now I'm doing with a space lamp demonstration also, especially this tutorial but this will be a totally 
live so guys there will be no a little bit edit wide so here now see here it has imported here we will have to select quick flash mode don't select the retain user data otherwise all the apps and application that we have the cleared all the retaining data we had a clear so that will be a retained so there will be no benefit to, uh, to especially so don't select quick flash mode we will have to select don't select the entry recovery don't select the fixed flash after selections the quick flash mode will prefer to execute and here don't select the fixed battery health during flash and leave it on itself now it will go in a recovery once again or exit yeah maybe a space late exit and don't do extra anything now leave it at the end of this tutorial two three crucial steps that we will have to execute and without touching on this device we will generate a new apple id and password by virtue of itunes guys and we would transfer that id on it and as a new ones yes we can enjoy of this device we cannot send the customer will enjoy guys so now let's see what's going to happen it has a restore on the nine percent 19 percent is until unless it's not notifying any error don't do anything so guys here yes during the space alignment flashing the process the device may restart multiple times so please don't unplug the device guys otherwise you will have a problem the problem is that yes it will be stuck on apple logo second thing also don't yes disconnect the internet connection yes you should have a second alternative internet connection also quickly within a 30 second you can connect another connection if internet connection is not functioning proper with them that's why i had already downloaded and this firmware because i'm sure that data is sufficient on an internet connection now so now here wi-fi i have a connected right now now we will see especially if any error will come so then we will try to fix by another internet connections and one thing more also we will have to find out the sales area of particular any iphone device suppose this phone belongs to hong kong so we will have to customize the precise location of your internet connection on your pc or laptop yes same location so that in a cloud data and in an apple database server will be a good configuration so there will be no chances to have any error otherwise this will give you error multiple times guys sometimes of course you will have to use the virtual private networks to other customize to fix this kind of the issues right now we will see any error will come and then of course we will try to fix it so please don't escape please don't escape this tutorial every yes step is very crucial and very important for us so in a midst of any error will comes that thing also we will fix it and do a step by step with similar status you guys now we can see here it is requesting ean data on a 52 percent don't worry we will wait here i don't know is it disable or not but do a similar strategy if you will have any confusion query or especially it's beyond of us or beyond of you especially my language then of course you can raise a comment according to other your query we will try to reply in a text form or not especially in the comment box guys don't worry during the flashing process of course i repeat once again your device may restart the multiple times or maybe look at on the physical it's accelerating and there it is stuck to on especially 52 percent is but don't worry don't do extra anything still it's not notifying any error all the tools and driver download link i will give you below the description box and there would be especially directly you can download from there through your tool is a totally free amazing pc trial version you can apply and itunes is absolutely free you know that 
and this firmware can be downloaded i repeat once again from ipsw.vita.coms ipsw.coms or it can be downloaded from www.3u.coms and on itself www.apple.coms now we have raised on a 63 percentage the creating protected volumes phase and here we have raised more than 90 percent is look at what's the difference between it don't worry so that's why this tool has to uh, jump from 63 to maybe 80 90 or 70 because now we can see here almost 95 percent is we have a completed guys here we are waiting for it because we have to unlock three more devices today on what's the device you would like to have a tutorial on these channels yes you can drop your comments or demand don't worry when at my shows especially that particular device comes then of course we will try to make it tutorial step by step how do you unlock because some of the particular device there is a specific problem either of course maybe sometimes on a hardware problem sometimes on a software problem sometimes on especially iCloud, lock to owners, time screen passcode, sometimes especially mobile device management lock. So there are the various kind of the issues on special iOS. So now that we have raised to on a 72 percentage, we will have to wait. Yes, I'm still waiting, guys. Still, I could not got any error here still so we will see further see data cable is connected in front of you this is old data cable I try to use a new data cable otherwise it will sometimes disconnect so that's why I fold it here so it will not move because multiple devices actually have been using in a day especially to unlock so that's why it became a finally old ones so now see congratulations clean flash has been completed given a message so here now what we will do we will come on a toolbox we will wait for batch activation when it will be highlighted within a 30 second we will have to execute it so we will see here we will wait why we will execute these things because without touching on this device we will have to execute to skip everything face id touch id screen passcode apple id everything's very well because this feature has been especially designed to unlock this will give you error when you did not clear console or console uh, all the retaining data from my uh, special in the cloud database by a console clearing or you did not clear especially um, crash analysis retaining data from especially apple database then it will give you error so let's see if it's not cleared very well then it will give an error here and if it has cleared everything so maybe it will especially it will give succeed we will see further here we will have to have a patience because it will take a scarcely two to three minutes maybe or sometimes one minute but try to check it out internet connection should be always connected otherwise it will give you error it will be a functional not will be a functional and yes if everything is fine internet connection is quite good everything is done but however error is coming on a batch activation or maybe especially a skipping error then we will have to change the internet connection of your pc or laptop and then once again we will have to execute this start option here we will have to click on a start however error is coming so then we will have to go for virtual private networks to the customized precise location of your pc or laptop and the point of course we will clear i'm extremely exhausted today guys especially at my shops now let's see further what's going to happen so still i could not go to any error now succeed here green sign green sign so we'll go for okay now we will come in especially deactivations we will have to wait uh, here 10 seconds so we will start so it's asking it has accounted here 
yes this apple device has notified that it has now connected so now we are ready to have a configuration so firstly let it succeed on here yes this device is now fully confirmed that there is no retaining data there is no link so we will make it sure by especially assessing data by virtue of itunes itunes will give a good configuration either it is in a cloud data or apple database server now let's see what's going to happen here still white screen is coming don't worry once again it will assess the data and upon c two times let's check it out in the multiple times what's the saying yes fine it's the saying should welcome to new one so now there is no chances that it is linked to particular any id and it will ask enter the apple id and password so just we will come in a, what i did here guys we will come on a here to sign in sign in to of course we will go for create new apple id and password so just by that without touching on this directly we will transfer the new apple id and password on here write a email password and it's asking here verification password accept term and condition and go for continue yes select the reasons country and go for continue when we will go for i'm the continuing and then what will happen here yes we will have to proceed at two three term and condition and the criteria a requirement and after proceeding this id directly would be a transfer on here still it's not a year start so the waiting for it but finally everything i have done guys now there is no chances because after assessing the data it's saying to that yes welcome to means and there is no now here two times it will come on a hello screen so check it out here one more time if i select the language once again it will drop and once again we will click on here select the language and here do a step by step guys here we will click on it select the language and it's a setting a language guys we will wait here yes we will have to wait wait now we will go for once again here don't click on a erase and start again here we have option that continue with partial setup so we will have to come with continue with partial setup and see guys what is here guys there is no links there is nothing inside of that now see it's asking here internet connection so while you're doing everything so there should be no sim card guys inside of it otherwise you will have the problem of navigation i have already mentioned to you it happens on some of the device guys so that's why there should be no sim card clear now connect to the internet to assign it into your device now it's very clear that we will insert the sim card and if see the sim card is not going to valid or sim card is not going to functional then directly we can connect to wi-fi and we can create here new apple id but however we will not connect to wi-fi we will not here insert the sim card then directly by using itunes we can transfer new apple id two options third is uh, of course we will insert the sim card if the sim card is not functioning then what we will do guys here see everything is a uh, disabled so permanently it's a permanent method now what we will do guys here just we will come on especially here to make it the virtual locations to uh, come on a true location so now it will be restarted and it will be a restore the true location of the particular this device in your area so you will insert the sim card sim card will be fully functional so it will not ask you connect to the internet connection on your sim gprs of course you can connect and upon internet connections and after connecting you can create new apple id and password everything so as a new one so you can enjoy it so now see directly it came on a home screens sometimes we are using some chargeable tool and after jailbreak uh, once again it is stacked on a space like loves but now it's so welcoming again so guys so this is all about thank you thank you very much indeed furthermore any inquiry of course i have a query below the comment box guys plus would be managed to reply your query so thank you thank you for staying till the end of this tutorial